Okay, so following on today from yesterday's talk about regedit.exe and registry keys, uh, I'm just going to show you how to automate the process of adding registry keys, how to make your own and how to remove them using .reg files. So um, the first step is we're going to have a look at um, the registry and what we're going to do is um, basically if you export the key that we had yesterday um, Microsoft regedit.exe will produce this file. Uh, this header here is very important. You must put that in the files, otherwise the uh, Windows registry um, piece of code that adds the registry entry to the registry will not recognize your file as being a .reg file. So that's, that's pretty important. Next, we have the location of the key and where it's going to be added to. And then below, we have the values that need to be added to that key. Right, so uh, what we're going to do is we're going to use this file here, and this is just a demonstration to show you um, adding hello world to the registry using a uh, .reg file. So this is our own .reg file. Now, basically, the structure is hive name, key name, sub key name, value, and then the value that you want that value to be set to. You can set these to uh, hex values and D word values for integers. Um, if you have a look on the wiki, I'll put the link up on the screen now so you can check it out yourself. There's lots of different options you can check out for adding um, data types to the registry. Okay, so now back to Hello World. I'm just going to run this. Give it permission. Okay. And that's telling me that it's been successfully added to the registry. So I'm just going to nip to the uh, registry editor and here you can see um, in the uh, software section under local machine we have a new value of hello world and it has a, um, a value against this entry of hello which means it successfully worked so now um, I'm just going to talk about removing registry entries using reg files the only difference between the remove option is you put a minus at the front of the registry um, uh, of the path to the key so uh, I have that in a reg file here and I'm just going to run that. It's new. Yes. Okay. And if we look at the registry entry now, you'll notice that hello world has disappeared. Uh, this makes life easy if you're automating processes and you want to install the reg file on multiple computers. Um, so say for instance you wanted to use that security hack, but you wanted to put it on six different computers. Save loading regedit.exe and navigating through the, um, the registry entries to add that key and then having to remember what the key is, you can just put it into one file, double click it and it will go onto the machine. Um, now I'm going to do some, uh, some more videos soon, I'm hopefully, hopefully going to get a chance to make some lock picks because I'd love to show you guys some lock picking. Um, and if you've got any questions, comments, suggestions, um, you can hit me up on Twitter, Hackology. And you can also hit me up on uh, on YouTube, or if you really want, you can email me, and that's illskills1982 at Google Mail. I'll see you guys soon. Have fun hacking. <laughs>